What's going on? Welcome to Celeb Circle. I'm your host, Alex Schiffman. I'm Jay Corvitz. I'm Emily Marcus. And I'm Zachary Reality. And today we're talking about someone that has been all over the headlines, Kanye West. Because listen to this. The world can never seem to get enough Kanye, it seems. And the rapper kept his name in the headlines every single day this week yet again. Part of that is because of the fanfare for his Netflix documentary, Genius. Part of it is also the progression of his divorce with Kim Kardashian, where a court officially ruled her single this week. But the story we are focusing on is the music video Kanye dropped along the game for his song, Easy. In the video, a claymation version of Kanye carries a bag filled with a severed head that appears to be Pete Davidson. He then pulls him out and begins burying his head. The video ends with the words, quote, everyone lived happily ever after except Skeet. You know who, JK, he's fine. So, was this tasteless coming from Ye or was no. this art? No, this was art. I mean, this is art of the highest form as far as I'm concerned. He, this is Kanye's way of venting his frustrations with his divorce, his anger towards Skeet. Um, and Aren't rightfully you a big so. He ruined fan? him. Listen, he ruined it by saying, JK, everything's fine, it's all fine. <laughs> like, if you're going to be a method actor, commit. Like, don't back down and, like, say, never mind, there's no severed head. Is there a severed head or not, Kanye? It's, 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 there's no gray area here. It felt like a little bit of trolling, which is something we would expect from him because that's what he's been doing on this relationship for the past few weeks. However, I think it took things a little too far, and it's it's suffering to Pete. I mean, he's probably scared to leave his house. No wonder he's such an introvert. I think Look. he's good. Yeah. Skeet, Three points for Skeet Pete. wanted to I be mean, with Kim. Justice for enough. Pete. <laughs> Skeet wanted to be with Kim, and now he has to face the consequences of that. Which are things like if, this. If like he's he scared. Knew, these people know what they sign up for. That's true. If he's and scared, he okay. can hide inside in one of, one of her giant puffers and call it a day. It's going <laughs> to be She does have fine. giant puffers and she gonna does have fine. mansions okay. and houses. I mean, I feel like Pete did know what he was signing up for. I mean, Kim has a crazy ex. Like, this is the price you pay when you date someone with a crazy ex. Yeah. And he's decided, you know, it's worth it. For the booty. I mean, some people will say he did, decided nice to date booty. Kim Kardashian. He didn't decide to get harassed by her Kanye, ex. Yeah, right? well, again, that's, you know the deal. You know who, who Kanye is. And he also could pull out of the relationship anytime he wants. He doesn't yeah. have to date Kim. I mean, she doesn't even live on the same coast as him, and she has four children while he's in his 20s. So it's like he's doing this because he really likes her. Yeah. Well, he's actually looking for a home in L.A. I don't know if you guys heard oh, that. Yeah. What part of L.A? Calabasas? <laughs> I mean, where else? <laughs> <laughs> Probably. Kim has helped. They were like photos all over. I think it was TMZ. Look, I don't know about you guys, but I think that this claymation animation was a turning point. I think that Skeet will look to get out of this relationship. Soon. When? Tomorrow. And then you know who he should rebound with? Julia Fox. <laughs> think I think he already it. got with Julia Fox. They just, it's low key. Super low key, yeah. I can see that. Is that true? Yeah, way back when they did that shoot together in that magazine. Wow. Well, yay, em yay Emily, knew. Yay knew let me saying. ask you this. Do you think that this was for PR to get more people to watch the music video? No. Kanye can breathe and it's PR. Fair I don't enough. think Kanye needs press. I think he's just, like, unwell. If anything, truly. it was PR for Skeet. I mean, well, he wasn't do, involved. Do we want severed head PR? Probably not. Like hey. oh, that reminds me of some Kim, other thing. Kim will be the first to tell Skeet all PR is good PR. I think we... that Ch what's her name? The new lookalike chick? Chaney? Chaney? Yeah, Chaney. Yeah, Chaney. yeah, what's up with her? <laughs> we don't talk about her. We don't talk about her because we don't know her name. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Chaney Jones. I think it's Chaney. Chaney Jones, yeah. yeah. Okay. I mean, Julia Fox who? Like, that happened fast also. I just want to know what Kanye's endgame is. And he's literally exposing everybody on his team on social media who, like, endgame. gets out of place. So it's like, where are we going and who is, like, checking you? His endgame is to reunite his family and to fight He might just be crazy enough to do racism. it. That's the thing. Every single thing he does that's more ludicrous than the next, it's like, he might just. I mean, it's he will. Crazy. He doesn't he take L's. This is yay we're talking about. But he's going to take an L on this one because Kim is not going to take him back. He's being ridiculous and immature. I, I actually think that he blasted Pete so that he could get more views in the video. I don't think that it would have gotten as many clicks if he didn't. He made that head oh. famous. The more people talking, the, the yay, more he wants. Yay is an artist. And what Look artist? That, I'm, like, I'm winning this round. One more. Yes, wow. you are. I'm you rubbing are off on him. But I do agree that, you know, Kim is now officially single. Final thoughts. Do you think there's ever going to be Ye a reconciliation between these two? an artist. He does what artists do, which is express their soul 
through their art. And Kanye Soul right now wants to cut off Skeet Davidson's head and bury it. Because that's how he feels. My soul wants to cut off your head. Because <laughs> that's how he feels. Violence and that, is he has, never the answer. Never. It's honest. He can be very it's hurt. This is the guy who made the song, emotional. I Thought About Killing You. <laughs> he right. song called he's just All right. being an well, artist. I think Matthew's totally going to win this one because, like I said, violence is never the answer. Never. I understand everyone is, can you express this? themselves you however they want to. This is exactly what Kanye You'll is get talking about. Yes. This is exactly what Kanye is talking about. And thank you so much about. for joining us on Celeb Circle. I'm your host, Alex Schiffman. I'm Jake Horvitz. I'm Emily Marcus. And I'm Zachary Reality. Follow Hollywire for your 24-7 celebrity news.